Machine learning helps detect undesired behaviors in your observability data. This makes it easier to spot performance degradation in your applications, services, or instances. In this video, you'll learn how to automate anomaly detections using machine learning on your observability data. Let's start with APM. The service map is a great tool to check our microservices architecture, and it can also provide health indicators when anomaly detection is enabled. Right now, we don't have any health indicators because all services appear in a gray circle. Let's see how we can enable them. The Elastic Stack comes with a lot of out-of-the-box jobs. Some of them can help you calculate anomaly scores on APM transaction durations. To enable them, just select the environments where you want to use them. Now, if we go back to the service map, we can see the health indicators for each service and how our architecture is affected. Services with a green circle are healthy. The yellow circles indicate services with anomalous activities that might degrade them. Unhealthy applications appear in a double red circle. In our architecture, the front end and other services are unhealthy, so we should investigate what needs to be fixed. Machine learning integrations are also available in other observability apps. For example, we can enable anomaly detection on memory usage and network traffic of our hosts. Before being able to detect anomalies, we should choose which date will be used to create the model for the machine learning job. It looks like it detected some memory and network issues that should be investigated. When it comes to logs, you can also use machine learning integrations to observe the static parts of log messages. This can be used to cluster similar messages together and classify them into message categories. An important anomaly was found in our logs, which might be related to the anomalies found by APM and metrics jobs. We can check the results of the jobs we just created in the machine learning app, where we can manage and delete existing jobs or eventually create new ones. In this video, you learned how easy it is to create machine learning jobs to detect anomalies on your observability data. You also learned that machine learning integrations are available everywhere, making it easy to spot anomalies across all your observability data. Thanks for watching this short video about anomaly detection on observability data using machine learning. Check out the reference links to learn more.